I got a chance to interview artist Lev Yilmaz, who is the creator of Tales of Mere Existence, a quirky animated comic strip that's making it big. One of my most obvious influences, the comic that Matt Groening was doing before he started in on The Simpsons, Life in Hell. It's always going to be from a guy's point of view. Uh, at the same time, I think that, uh, weirdly enough, I think that the audience is actually leans heavier towards women. The two primary pieces of source material were a, um, an old uh, movie that was done, I believe, in the 50s. Yeah, uh, 56, um, Mystery Picasso. That's it. I'm not really sure what it is, but there's something about a girl wearing one of those neck choker things that makes me kind of horny. I didn't think that a very normal sounding voice would work. I started with, like, you know, kind of imitating Stephen Wright. You know, when you put a stick in the water, it looks like it's bent, but it really isn't. That's why I don't take baths. <laughs> How to break up with your girlfriend in 64 easy steps. The series really gathered up a lot of uh, steam with a piece called uh, How to Break Up with Your Girlfriend in 64 Easy Steps. Phase 2, The Second Childhood. Feeling of Relief. Are these truly about your family, or is this sort of a fantasy family? It's very close. I mean, like that with, with all of the stories, I take a few liberties here and there. Do they like being part of these? Well, the one thing that happens is that, I mean, particularly with my mom, is like, you know, that, uh, that we'll be talking about something, and then she'll kind of like stop and say, this isn't going to end up in a video, is <laughs> it? I've always thought the term God-fearing was odd because I can't think of a single instance where fear and paranoia brought out the best in people. Whenever, like, I start to get to, to get this sort of fancy pants idea that I'm uh, that I'm doing um, anything other than just a, than just a pure expression, things start to go wrong. When I start mm -hmm. to uh, um, uh, get too premeditated, then things start to go wrong. So I just sort of shut that part of my brain off. 